sitting at the crossroads of a tiny town sits a tiny sign. My passion is helping people. And three small words. Free Meals Friday. I want to feed the public. I want to bless people. Making a difference. Times are tight down here. Here in McKinney. And when they came to the table, the smile that they had on their face, beautiful. Yes, they were so thankful. With each scoop of potato salad, it's a need. Each scoop of green beans. There's a lot of people who really don't have a lot of things. What Carolyn has is a barber shop. I cut men hair, women hair, children hair. And a desire to fulfill a recent dream. I woke up in the middle of the night with this dream, and it just kept saying it over and over again, Free Meals Friday, and I said, what? It's this. I think for her to have that idea to be put into her soul, it's just brilliant. Acting on faith with her husband, Carolyn decided to pay out of her own pocket for the first free meal. I just never miss the money. God's been good. A few donations have come in, and on this day, the Pulley family decides to donate in memory of a loved one. In honor of our dear brother who passed um, at the young age of 62 from MS, multiple sclerosis. And when our niece, Siobhan, had talked to Carolyn, we just wanted to partner with her and to just bless the people who needed food for today. A short time after the tablecloths are placed down, another Free Meals Friday is in the books. And for Carolyn... Doing it has made my heart happy. About 50 lunches went out on this Friday, a warm plate on a cold day. Carolyn Owens Trotter changing lives one meal at a time. Working for you, Wayne Koval, CBS 6 News. Oh man, what an awesome idea. And a lot of people certainly benefited. And if I can say that food looked amazing. Yes, it was. <laughs> you feel you could feel that people being together brought them comfort, and then that was just looked like good comfort mm -hmm. food to go with it. I could use That's some wonderful. of that.